Okay guys, this for those technician using Otis and uh, you end up replacing an immobilizer item or control unit like uh, maybe a J519 or uh, the which is the body control module or the comfort module which is J393 and you gotta program the key usually Audi does this uh, eventually in the Otis test plan is gonna have a pop-up saying that you need to request permission to swap an immobilizer master it's legitimate you want to print this page with all the info the day the bin will be here i blocked it okay i usually scan this and then email it to this email right here that they give you it's legitimate okay you gotta follow this otherwise you won't have access to program the keys to the new newly uh control unit that you install in the car so after that they're gonna if it's weekdays they're gonna respond within within 24 hours if it's the weekend it might take a couple days okay you just gotta keep follow up on your emails uh in this case i already got email saying that it's okay to try it again and i did it and it's okay now and uh that's it and now you could go back go back here usually you, you you're gonna use immobilizer servicing right here like i already did it that's why it's there so i'm gonna show you how to find it you gotta select self-test and then you're gonna hit a search here okay and then immobilizer servicing that's what you're gonna be using you pop you click on it and then you're gonna attach it to the test plan attach it so you'll then shift to this side here and you got it in the test plan okay so i already did it okay let's close it and that it will pop it will pop up here like it did for me right here i got a check mark because i already did a test plan okay in your case you're not going to have a check mark there you're just going to click servicing mobile uh mobilizer servicing and just follow follow up follow the time follow um, orders and you'll be fine okay i hope that helps you